Right, good everyone. Uh, okay, had this Ryobi chainsaw for a while now. I'm quite happy with it. Uh, however, the cord has just stopped uh, returning. Now, I'm forced to pull it apart. I've got a bit confused in that I took off the top bit and here's a spring. And so, okay, I located that and I've turned it around a few times and tried to lock it in and it doesn't do anything. And I was, what was confusing is that I thought that this spring on top is what retracted the string, but it doesn't. It just puts a little bit of tension or something. Yeah, the real spring is underneath. It's this very long spring. And that has come disengaged from the bottom of this piece. So obviously it just, get this in the light. So this tab just here will engage on this piece here. Yeah, it was greased up and it's full of... Um, yeah, sawdust and stuff, so I'll clean that one a little bit. I'll put some new grease. Uh, I'll also clean around here. There's a lot of sawdust in here. So, yeah, I just thought I'd make a short video because, yeah, I got confused at the, at the beginning because there is this second spring, and I couldn't figure out how this second spring was going to do anything or how it was going to pull the cord back. So, but, yeah. Anyway, figured it out now. I'll put it back to some new grease in it. There's nothing breaking. It's just come unhooked. So I don't know how it managed to come unhooked, but anyway. So yeah, this piece here engages into this black area, and you see just here, there's another little tab piece coming out, and that will engage the the outer side of the spring. So, there you go.